Hello guys and welcome to another batch scripting tutorial. In this lesson we are going to learn about command substitution. Uh, command substitution allows us to reassign the output of a command and uh, assign it to a variable or uh, assign it to a, a text or, or some other context. Uh, for example, um, if I wanted to uh, assign the output of the ls-1 file one that jpg uh, that is going to give me that file name so if I wanted to create a variable for example my picture and I wanted to assign the name of this file I open command substitution and then I insert this command or the command that I um, that I'm using in this case the ls minus one file one dot jpg and finally I'm going to close parentheses I press enter and now if I echo the my picture variable now it contains the name of the file so if you notice before I use the command within command substitution I tested out the command and once I know I'm getting the intended output now I can use the exact command within command substitution because it's, it's hard for uh, you to um, right off the bat uh, insert your your command inside command substitution and then when you echo your variable you find out you're not getting uh, the right output another way we can use command substitution is for example if I wanted to create an array an array called uh, dear content and this will be an array that will contain uh, the content of the test directory uh, meaning that it will contain all the uh, files and directories so I could uh, first find a command that is going to give me a listing of all the files and directories and the ls-1 it is just that command if I press enter it will give me just the file name of everything within that directory so next I could say for example um, declare my variable open and close in parentheses and within uh, the parentheses I declare command substitution I can say ls minus one and then I close command substitution I press enter and now if I echo the array now it contains uh, all the files and directory within the test directory so this is another way we can use command substitution I can also use uh, command substitution um, within another command for example let's say that I wanted to say echo today is in displaying uh, today's date uh, for example I can find a command that is going to give me the date I'm going to use the date command and I'm going to format the output using uh, a option and that will give me uh, today's day uh, actually uh, the day of the week and so I could say echo today is and then I can uh, insert command substitution within uh, within that command so I could say date and uh, capital A option and I could close um, command substitution then close double uh, double quotes press enter and now I got today is Thursday I could also create a variable called uh, today and um, say equals command substitution day uh, plus a echo today and today is Thursday another way I could use uh, the date command within command substitution is for example if I wanted to create a directory <coughs> called pictures and I wanted to insert the date uh, within that directory name I could say the, uh, open command substitution date command uh, and I'm going to format the date using uh, the M uh, capital F option and then I press enter if I list the pictures directory notice that and now I have the date embedded within the name of the directory 
I can do the same uh, when creating a file I can say my pick and then I can embed the day within the file name I can also embed uh, the day using command substitution for example when creating logs I could say ping send one packet to a specific host and then I could redirect the output into a file and I could call the file yahoo.com connection and then I embedding I'm embedding the date inside the file name if I list now the yahoo.com file now it contains the date embedded in it and finally we can use command substitution within uh, another command for example let's say that I wanted to output um, I wanted to output all the logs files pertaining to today's date so I'm going to say I could say uh, grab June 30 from var log authorization log and that will give me all the um, the file the um, the log uh, entries for today's uh, but if you want to use this command within a script you can uh, you cannot embed uh, or hard code the today's state uh, inside that script so this is one example we can use command substitution we can say open command substitution we could say date press uh, insert it right there and uh, let's see oh forgot to close command substitution let's call it again I need to close command substitution here press enter and this time we got uh, the right output so I'm going to stop right here I hope I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and uh, thanks for watching